Hello friends of pottery. In this video I will show you how to make a ball. How to make a ball with my self-made potter's wheel. I just finished to center the mass and have opened it. I'm working with my right foot at the same time as throwing the mess. But you c can give it a rest because uh, the rotational energy of uh, the wooden uh, mass of this wheel is enough uh, to throw the mass um, for some time. It's important to have your fingers wetted with the, a deep suspension of clay. I like to make uh, this uh, drills that you see. the fingers and uh, then you can see that it's made by hand. It's I don't like to make it perfectly symmetric. The pottery wheel is made out of wood recycled wood. There's two ball bearings at the head and at the foot. The spinning mass is about uh, 50 pounds. It's easy to pull. I have the measure, the diameter, because I make uh, this ball from two vessels which I will put together. Some people can make it in, in one piece but I, I cannot do this. It's much easier to make two pieces and join them together. You see the wheels of the finger? which are a sign that uh, this piece is handmade. The coincidence of the two diameters is important. One piece is a little a bit greater than the other. That, that they will fit together. I'm putting inside a ball of uh, newspaper so uh, that the ball won't collapse and this give it stability. Now I close this ball and if it's closed and the, the air cannot esca escape uh, so that it is uh, gives it stability. Once again, some some non-symmetric uh, rotation, but I don't mind. It doesn't bother me. In, on the contrary, I'm I like it. I like it when the ball is not uh, totally uh, uh, rotational symmetric. It is no perfect ball. It's it's an object like the earth. Now you can you can quit some some clay, which is the bottom of one of these vessels, making some corrections because uh, they did not uh, fit 
very good together. Now the ball is relatively stable because of the newspaper inside and, and the air which is enclosed inside and couldn't escape so give some pressure inside and uh, on burning the ball the newspaper will also be burned to ashes now we'll quit some some clay making the ball thickness a little bit uh, smaller at the left uh, on the corner you see uh, an object which also is made of, of a ball and later is opened to give him a little hole for putting uh, flowers or whatever inside but it's uh, an object this video should also demonstrate that the, the self-made uh, pottery wheel is working very well I'll smoothen the surface with some toy. Now, all my toys uh, are made of wood and uh, exactly a knife or something, but uh, it's all made by hand and also the clay which I use is uh, made by me. Uh, I find this clay near my house. It's a volcanic bentonite-like uh, clay which can take up very much water and therefore I had to to mix it uh, with some sand, volcanic sand or volcanic ashes. I will cut it. and give it a turn to work out the foot see that you can handle it quite easy it's, it has a uh, stability well if it's not exactly centered it, it, it doesn't matter to me It's uh, nearly finished, and it's uh, yeah, the only process is uh, to to quit some some clay. Mm, you could work with this uh, ball, open it, uh, making uh, some more artistic object of it. Or you can burn it as it is. But if you burn this uh, ball as it is, you have to make a, a little hole. Otherwise, um, if the the air and the water uh, cannot escape by burning this ball, it could be explode. Okay, if you want to see more of these objects, you're invited to visit my homepage. Thank you for listening. Goodbye.